guys, the story I'm going to read tonight is brand new. It was written this year. It's from The Book of Hope, which is a collection of short stories by lots of children's authors. It's going to be published this autumn in aid of the NHS charities. I hope you're going to enjoy this one. My First Expedition to the Wilderness by Ed Clark. We had pitched the tent as far from civilization as we'd dared. And it was my mission to spend the night in it alone. I'd only myself to blame because I had suggested it. I'd wanted to prove that I had what it took. But as I zipped up the door of my tent and shut out the pitch black night, I immediately had my regrets. My shelter seemed impossibly flimsy against the elements. The slightest breeze made it sway. What if a storm came to tug it from its mooring? What if spindly fingers of lightning found their way to the tent poles? I steadied my nerves and I climbed into my sleeping bag, pulling it all the way up to my chin. It felt safer that way. I stared up at the faint shadows cast across my billowy cotton ceiling. Vegetation of some kind, I thought, or rather, hopes. I'd seen bushes outside before I got in, but as I said, just outside the tent, creature or creatures. Ooh, could it be bears? Did bears live here? I took a deep breath to calm myself. No, the noise wasn't loud enough for bears and it would be more snuffly. Perhaps it was a fox on the prowl. Uh, could foxes get into tents? I stared at my zipped door. It seemed secure. It would hold, wouldn't it? But it was cold, colder than I thought it would be. I should have brought more clothes. It was too far to go back now. I tried to stop myself shivering by curling up into a ball. And then somewhere in the darkness, a bird sang. And then another. The birds would keep watch of me, I thought. The company of birds would mean I wasn't alone. Another was outside. I was calmer now. It was probably just a mouse. A tiny mother mouse, out searching for food for its children. And then I imagined all the creatures outside, great and small, all with their families to care for, sheltering from the weather, waiting for the light of day to come. We were all together, out here in the dark wilderness. I've got a hot chocolate out here for you, Poppet, came a voice from outside the tent. I wriggled over to the door. I thrust out my hand and I took a steaming mug from my dad. I'm a bit old to be called Poppet, Dad, I replied. Sorry, Poppet. Are you sure you're going to be okay out here? Yep, no problem. Good for you. Night, night. The hot drink warmed me. As I watched, my dad pad back to the house in his slippers. I zipped the tent back up and I began to settle back down. The wilderness was my back garden again and the night was my friend. <laughs>